we're looking at the Emacs. Now make sure you get all the tasks correctly. Let me just scroll down and show you everything. So yes, yes, it's a lot. So we will be looking at this one by one. Sit back, relax, and yeah, you have to look through all of these resources. All of these are very important. All of these resources. You have to read through all of these. I'm not going to do that because I've already done that and I've I've done my part. So these are the requirements. This is what you need to keep in mind as you solve this. So, 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 first, let's go to the first question. This is the answer, false. Um, the question is, you can only have one buffer open at Emacs at a time. Okay, that's false. Then, in Emacs, what does M in a shortcut command stand for? So, that's all correct answers. Alt and meta. In Emacs, a buffer is an object that a file's text is held in. True. In Emacs documentation, what does C in a shortcut command stand for? That is control. Okay, we're done with that. Let's now move on to the tasks. Um, create your answer directory. So, firstly, to do this, click on get a sandbox and then click on web terminal right here. So, the first question says, navigate to roots and create a directory named OX02Emacs. So, let's go to sandbox, then web terminal. So, we are in. Let's begin. So, to navigate to roots, what you will do is CD roots. Mm -hmm. Then you are in roots now. I said to create a directory named Emacs, you simply type mkdir, that is make directory, then oh, then you just, just copy this right here and paste it here. So that is make directory Emacs. You would press enter and you are good. To confirm your answer, press ls. This will list all the files. You are seeing it here, oxo 2 emacs so it's there already. Um, yeah, don't, don't, don't bother about all these other all these other files here. This once you've seen this one here, then you've done the correct one. Then you are correct. So let's move on to the next one. Opening. What is the command to open a file from within Emacs? Write the answer into the file root Emacs opening. You can validate it in the format blah blah blah. Okay, let's continue. So um go back to your sandbox to your to your command line. Yes. So the um to do that to solve this question, you type echo E C H O then C hyphen F C hyphen X then C hyphen F then the arrow then the name of the folder that is where you should put this in as the O X O two E marks forward slash opening then hit enter and then you've done the right thing you've done so click on check your code here click on start a new text so a new click on start a new test right here let it load let it load let it validate your answer let it load let it validate your answer that's it done so you can continue um saving so write the answer into the file roots emacs saving so what is the command to save a file so let's go back to our terminal you type firstly you move into that opening folder so that is to sorry you move into this this emacs folder that is OX, O2, Emacs, then LS, then opening is still inside, good. Then we'll continue. So next thing is to create a file called saving. Let's write the answer inside. You type echo, then C hyphen X, C hyphen S, then arrow saving, then hit enter. 
so you've done that you've done that click on check your code click on start a new test i've already done this before as i said before so i got in the answer correctly click on start a new test and there you go so scroll down cut and what's the command to cut an entire line Write the answer into cotton. Now go back to your terminal. Echo C hyphen K. Then the arrow cotton. Hit enter. You've gotten that correctly. Click on check your code. I'm not going to do that. I've already done that. So pasting. What's the command to paste? Um, put inside pasting. You type E C H O echo. C C hyphen Y. So the arrow paste in and hit enter. That's that's done. So check LS, then you see all, all your files here. Thomas is correct. You are doing the right thing. And scroll down searching. Searching. Right write the answer. What is the command to search forward? Write the answer into the file. The, if it's echo c hyphen s then the arrow saving i'm sorry searching then hit enter now next one is undoing what is the command to undo write the answer into the file emacs undoing the answer is type echo c hyphen x u then arrow undoing but that's it that's undoing now quitting the last one let's go what is the command to quit emacs write the answer to quitting so come back here echo c hyphen x then c hyphen c then quitting and there you go there you go there you go there you go so make sure you click on check check your code to make sure that you did the right thing so um once you are done your score up here will be 100 i was 50 because i did it late but and if you didn't notice i like to keep my videos as as straight straight to the point as possible um unless if you want me to explain it i'll make a separate videos to video to explain but if not i i like to go straight to the point if that's what you want subscribe to this channel for more like that thank you